Alright guys, so in this episode, I'm trying to remove my passenger seat, but the bolt is really, really stripped. Let me show you guys real quick. This bolt right here is extremely stripped, as you can see. So, um, brought it to a friend who is going to show us how to extract it. Wait, this truck's a 53 you said? 53. 53. There's a number of different ways. If you've got a bolt that's broken off, like a wheel stud, yeah. that's, that's flat, broken off, easiest way to get those out is take a welder and a bigger nut set over the bolt and weld in the center mm, and pick up the old that'll heat it up then let it cool and it'll walk right out yeah that's, that's right that's easy way this is we got too much crap in the way here too much yeah there's all the space you can fight it for days right and all you do is get frustrated and then you you remember this that you have this happen again yeah oh yeah I remember or you could do the same thing with a hammer and a chisel right you can but it's, this is a lot yeah especially since there's not like much space to get a hammer yeah, this 1500 1500 hammers per second so is, this, is it called an air chisel yeah. Okay. That's what you cut cars apart and shoot. <laughs> right. There. It's that body man's nightmare. It's a good tool. Alright, so when I first attempted to take this bolt out, we actually drilled a hole in it and uh, tried to like cut a slot in it for a big flathead. So when we did that, I don't know if you guys can see it, but we actually cut a hole through the threads in the frame. So the threads are really messed up now, so I have a tap here, and um, for the Miata seats, it's a uh, 10 millimeter 1.25 thread. So yeah, whenever you're um, running a tap through here, you gotta be really careful with it. So when you're running a tap through it, basically what you wanna do is um, you want to do half a turn in or so. Need a little more out of it. About half a turn in, and then you do about a quarter turn out. You just want to back it off a little bit. Because if you just keep on turning it clockwise, you can break the top. And tops are expensive, especially this one to snap on, and it's not mine. So yeah, half a turn in, roughly, quarter turn out. <laughs> 